and the ideals that we believe in and the things that we agree with comes up when I talk to average people. You can get inundated on social media from people who hear these things, share these things, talk about these things. These silly ideas are ideas that people in Arkansas all across the state hold and believe every single day. And we know resolution has no weight of law behind it, but this Senate body as a majority can make positional stands on issues that we typically don't get to, whether it's national issues, whether it's other issues that we do. You know what? You have a right to vote down any resolution you don't want to. You have a right to bring any resolution you want to, to be heard and discussed. But when you call it a waste of time to deal with issues that people care about, when you call it a waste of time, to arrogantly sit up there and think you know how to run things and your bills are perfect and your bills do substantial things. You know, that bill last time the Senator Henry talked about, it was a fundamentally flawed bill and egregiously so, if you want my opinion on it. We could have discussed it at that time. It gave legislative power to a non-governmental entity to examine different rules that we did to make sure. Uh, sir. Yes, sir. To make sure we had the power outside this legislative body. And once again, these issues are forefront in the media and with the intention of people we do. I'm proud we're having a debate. 90% of the time we're passing cleanup bills and things that do much that affect the people of Arkansas's lives. You think they care that a line three on page six got changed from one department to another? They're important. I get why we do them. He's not speaking on the bill. Objection. He can speak. He's speaking on resolution. Please he's speak. not speaking on this resolution. He's talking about China and Venezuela and all kinds of stuff. When you were speaking, you were speaking. When you were supposed to be asking questions, I'm going to cut your microphone off if you don't You talk. can cut it off. I'll cut it off. There's the biggest Senator Flowers. You don't have to agree with it. Cut yourself off. Please proceed, Senator. Thank you, Mr. President, for respecting this body and the rules we have in place. I'll finish with this. Senator Flowers' passion that you just saw. Dumb ass, you don't know nothing about it. Oh, <laughs> wow. Wow. You know, eventually that's going to become a real problem. People being able to interrupt senators like that. Go ahead. Please, I, I don't know what you said, but if it was foul language, please don't use that. We will deal with that. It's all right, Mr. President. Uh, we know that certain members of this body get carte blanche to insult and to disrespect other members when it comes to how this proceeding works. So I'll finish up with this. Please the passion please. that Senator Flowers and others have shown today, I think that's important for the people of Arkansas to see us care about these issues. And that's why I'm happy that we spoke and we discussed passionately <laughs> real life debate and we try to do it civil. Senator Chesterfield didn't attack anybody personally. I haven't attacked people personally. Might use some strong language for sure. But that's what's the great thing about the city. And even when we deal with contentious real issues, it's important that we do that. Thank you. Thank you. Lesson. I want to know if the people have a lot of latitude if they're speaking at the Less election, than four minutes. Not, I'm not up here to judge what a lot of it was interrupted by Senator Flowers. Probably would have been three minutes. Totally correct if that was my role, but it's not. Wow. My role is just let people talk. You don't want me correct. Because I'd be busy. Senator Dennis.